this is just a brief look at uh, some work in progress this is v and v miniatures a uh, norman banner rider banner man rider that i got free with the um v and v miniatures byzantine cataphracts 28 millimeter figure this is the horse i'm showing you um, it's been airbrushed. I thought I'd do it in uh, grey. As a, you know, it's a bit maybe a bit special as it's for a uh, the man leading the charge. I want a signal man to make it obvious. So that's uh, that's that part of it. It's very nice looking. These are resin 28 millimeter figures. Here's the banner that he's going to be holding. Um, this is the one that comes with the kit, except that I've uh, replaced the uh, pole here with uh, a bit of florist wire to make it easier for the figure to hold it. And this is really a bit too thin, but I thought it was a bit better than the uh, overly thick um, uh, part that was supplied with the kit. And we have just freehanded that. So that's that. Here's the rider himself. I'm just matte black um, undercoated it for this. Uh, if you can even read that Vallejo, like airbrushed on it. Uh, one of the really good things about it is um, if you can see where his sword joins there, underneath his um, uh, male armor. There's the um, sort of shape of a sword. You can just see the hilt, if you can make it out, sticking out at the top there. And this part here, this extra bit of the sword, that came as a separate piece. So um, I was quite impressed with that. The trouble the designer has gone to to make the um, make it look like there's a sword underneath the chainmail, and then um, um, supplying an extra piece. I was wondering when I was putting this together what. What was the little um, fixing point there for? So I could see that it was for the uh, for the rest of that sword, and that's the man. And this is the other part of the um, figure. The last little part is the shield, which is um, sort of almost finished. I've got to do the boss, and I've got to do the um, got to do the rim of the shield. I'm going to do that silver, silver coloured. I can just turn that over, show you the back. It does have like a red leather holder. Um, you'll see with these shields, they've got two two attachment points, and they attach on the uh, on the rider figure. <clears throat> it only goes in, in one direction, so you've got to kind of get it right. And, um, Tried to paint the individual planks and that. I might give it another going over with a bit of a, a wash. And then that's the front of it, which I just a freehand design. Um, similar to, but not the same as. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Some of the things I've seen on other figures. And um, anyway, I really just quite like to freehand paint and other things so I thought I'd give this a go as well and uh, I'm quite pleased with that this is just a short video to keep you in the picture so I'll just speak and please like and subscribe if, uh, if you do like it subscribe anyway see you next time bye